In this video, we will use DigitalOcean DNS server to point a domain to an IP address. In this case, we will point to IP address of a DigitalOcean droplet. This is the domain name we need to point to DigitalOcean. We already have a server created for this uh, domain name. You need to click on this networking link on the left menu. Then you can see all the domains. Uh, under this domain, you have the option to enter the new domain name. We copy and paste this domain name here. Then click on the Add Domain button. Once the domain is added, it will show you the names of it. ns1.digitalocean, ns2.digitalocean.com and ns3.digitalocean.com. What you need to do is uh, log into your domain name control panel, then change name server of the domain name to these three names. In this case, name server for this domain already pointed to uh, these name servers. You can verify it with command who is domain name. Then you will see the names of it, ns1.digitalocean and ns2, ns3.digitalocean. If these names are uh, correct, then uh, the domain is pointing to DigitalOcean. Uh, next, you need to point the domain to whatever IP you want the domain to be resolved. For the root domain name, you need to enter at the rate in the first text box. then you need to select the enter the IP address here or you can select if you have a droplet you can just select the droplet from here from the list then click on create record this will point the domain name without www to this specific IP address if you copy this and enter it will show the website but if you use www dot the domain name it won't work because we have not yet added a DNS record for the www subdomain so we need to create a DNS record for www subdomain so in the first hostname field enter www then you need to copy this IP or uh, you can select the droplet from here in this case I just enter the IP address that auto selected the droplet click on create record now if you visit this site it should work but it may take some time for the DNS uh, cache to resolve because when you visit this site the browser may cache the DNS for some time anyway let us see if it is working by refreshing it is not at working but if I take another browser uh, this browser don't have any cache so if I enter the domain with the www then it will work if it is not working just wait some time because DNS propagation take time you can just rest close this browser and restart it again then also it will uh, site with the www will work it is now working on Google Chrome also the DNS cache cleared quickly because we don't have any DNS entry before but if you have a DNS entry it will take more time are specified in the TTL value, time to leave value in the DNS zone. 